Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. How many of you guys have Wi-Fi out there? Um, can you feel the Wi-Fi just bouncing off you, like flowing through you, much like the Force does, the dark side of the Force? Just about everybody's got Wi-Fi these days, and we get questions about Wi-Fi all the time related to security. We answered that question the other day. Some people ask me what kind of uh, wireless access point that I happen to have, and more specifically, uh, a question was asked today, I think Lynn uh, asked this one, uh, how about boosting your Wi-Fi signal? Is there a difference between trying to get a Wi-Fi signal to travel horizontally through walls and having the signal travel from downstairs to upstairs or upstairs to downstairs? That's a really good question. Part of it can be solved with software and part of it can be solved with hardware. Uh, on the software side of things, my router is a Linksys router and I've had it for a few years now. But instead of using the software that it comes with by default from Linksys, um, I've got the ability to flash the firmware or change the software on the router that allows the hardware to be configured to an open source uh, firmware uh, that's based on Hyper WRT. Uh, it's called Tbor 15C. Now, if I lost you on those last two items, don't freak out. You don't necessarily need this. But this open source Tbor 15C allows me to boost the transmit power of the antenna on my wireless router from the default of 50% to 100% so I get even more range out of that little box and it works well. So on top of the software tweak that I've got, I've also added a Linksys high gain antenna kit with the right connectors for that particular wireless router and that's also helped uh, boost the signal strength uh, as I have the wireless router currently located in my basement, in the middle of the basement so I can actually access uh, that wireless router from here, from inside the office, which isn't exactly um, too far away, but it's it's having to travel through a couple of walls and untold amount of signals. Uh, in areas where I have a, a decreased range, uh, as in the back room or our exercise room, instead of relying on a built-in adapter, I've picked up and I asked for I asked this. Uh, as I asked for this as a gift for Christmas and I got it, but I also had it on our wedding registry and someone else got it, so I've got two of these now. It's great. It's a high gain USB wireless uh, G adapter from uh, uh, Hawking, yeah, Hawking Technology. And with it, just plugs in by USB and you install um, the software. And essentially, you can aim this dish in just about any direction. And since my router was uh, in the basement, I essentially had to lay it on its. <laughs> on the front side and point it directly down and it picked up the range as if the wireless router was sitting in the next room rather than two levels away. This really does work. Um, these are designed specifically to have um, going not just from inside one house but specifically from one building to another. So if my neighbor across the street had wireless access and I wanted to pick it up and knew how to and it was, you know, I wasn't stealing Wi-Fi of course that does happen, I could essentially point this dish directly at wherever that router or that access point happened to be and pick up the signal strength uh, very, very well. This is this is a very, very nice adapter. USB, uh, I don't know if it's Mac compatible, but it certainly works with Windows, and I've tried it. It does work very, 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 very well. Um, so, yeah, it, it, there can be an issue, uh, there, but there are different, uh, with, with the signal strength from your wireless router, and they all vary. Um, from manufacturer to manufacturer, device to device, firmware to firmware. All these elements come into play, but there are hardware uh, things that you can do, specifically getting different antenna for your router or you know a different adapter for your computer, or even, like I said, flashing the firmware or making sure you're getting the, the strongest signal uh, being uh, or boosting that signal as high as it can go from the access point in general. What do you guys do to boost your wireless access? You know, more importantly, I mean, do you clear out any other wireless signals that might be floating throughout your home? What do you do to get the strongest Wi-Fi signal ever? If you're interested in hearing more, leave your tips, tricks, advice, software, links, whatever uh, in the thread. Leave a message, comment, whatnot, or of course, stop by the chat room. We're always interested in hearing tips there. Live.perillo.com.